I think you just need to be really alert with what the potential safety concerns are. I mean, number one, no patient with type 2 diabetes who is on medication should be doing this on their own. It really needs to be done in conjunction with a physician who knows how to adjust those medications appropriately. And so for the physicians, you know, knowing where the dangers are and the biggest danger is with hypoglycemia. So we always have to have that number one on the list. So as a patient gets started on a low carbohydrate diet, I would much rather have that patient floating a little bit higher than we normally would have as a goal than too low. It's slightly higher, it's not immediately life-threatening. It's not immediately life-threatening, and that's as we're decreasing medications. And so, you know, obviously the goal how, how changes. How high is it's okay for you? Yeah, so my goal in the first few weeks for patients is usually to have their blood sugar between 120 and 180. If we stay in that range, you know, we are pretty comfortably able to stay away from any hypoglycemic events. Now, patients are really counseled on this. Any blood sugar under 120, they need to let us know about. Mm-hmm.